Hi, my name is Tammy. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. So today I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do to be at the top of Google search and beat out your competitor today who I put in as GF Bowman. So you're probably wondering why I'm making this video for you and it's pretty simple. Most business owners are too busy running their business and taking good care of their customers that they don't have time to learn how the internet, internet can bring them more business. And the only thing stopping them from hiring somebody is that they don't know who's an expert and who's not. So what I started doing was just creating these attack plans and giving them away for free. Some people take this information and do it themselves, and other people call me back and say, Tammy, I really like what you said. I just don't have the time to do it. Could you do it for me? So whatever you decide to do with this information is totally okay with me. My only goal is to educate you a little bit and make you a lot of money. So today we're just going to talk about three things, content, backlinks, and citations. So I want to start by saying when I got on your website, um, I really love your logo that you have up here at the top, the pictures that you have, that you have the Facebook and everything that's linked in over here. Um, Google, however, doesn't really care what your website looks like. They mostly care about the uh, content, which is all the words in here that you can read. So the more content you have, the better, because it makes Google look at you like you're an authority. And the average ad has about 1,500 words of content. So I went into wordcounter.net and brought you up just to speed things up. Um, and you're at 728. So having, um, if not the complete 1500 words would definitely optimize your website and put you in a better position to get to that number one spot. The more words you have, the more keywords you can stuff in here and you can really get your page to rank well. Also, um, your pictures over here, any pictures that you have, you could save those as keywords as well too. So. Um, the Google bot that uh, goes through the internet looking for key phrases and the relevancy to your line of work, they can pick up on any little keyword. So instead of numbers, you would definitely want to save those as um, HVAC Bristol, for example. Um, and then this one you want to save as another keyword. So um, HVAC South Jersey, something um, more relevant. So a second thing I wanted to talk about was um, backlinks. So a backlink is a website that has a link to your website and that link to your website could potentially be bringing you more traffic, but it's really important to keep in mind that not all are created equal. So um, say you did some work for Pizza Hut and they sent you a link and their whole website is about pizza. It's really not going to do any good for you as say another, um, uh, you know, HVAC company. It, that would be a lot more powerful for you. So we do have a paid tool that we use called Arifs to check out analytics for a website. So I went ahead and put you in already up at the top. So the UR is the trust that Google has in your website. So you're at 11. So as marketers, we like to see um, the circle filled up just a little bit more. Um, you do have 429 backlinks. So you have 52 sites that are linking back to you. So if somebody's on one site um, and they click something that could potentially be bringing them back to you. You do have 400 and, uh, 403 organic keywords and you're getting about 41 um, people each month. Now I'm gonna show you your competitor just cause they've already done the hard work for you. All you have to do is copy them. So if it's good enough to get them ranked on the first page, it's good enough to get you there too. So here I put them in at the top already. Um, so they have 1500 backlinks. Um, so they have 101 sites referring back to them. So that would be giving them more traffic. Um, they do have some more content within their website. So they are able to stuff in those keywords that we were talking about um, and why they're getting um, more organic traffic as well. So just some things to keep in mind, more content, um, and more backlinks. And the third thing that I would um, recommend is citations. So a citation is your business name, address, and phone number um, listed in various directories all throughout the web, like Yelp, Yellow Pages, and Facebook um, that you have. So in order to get in this um, position here that we call the map pack, you'd have to look at your competition and see what directories they're listed in. And um, don't just stop there, go go out and grab a few more. So go get listed in there, go grab a few more. And that way you're really dominating your competition in this space. So they would be somebody really easy to beat out. Um, if you do find yourself wanting to scale further, feel free to reach out and I can help you with some more information or we could talk about some goals for your business um, and I could do some more research for you. 
So it's so important to be up here on the first page. I don't know the last time you searched for something. I'm sure you didn't go to page seven or eight to look for something. Um, so 30% of the revenue goes to these three businesses up here that are organic and the other um, 10 go down to these ones below on the first page. So um, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.